Welcome to the Pyramid Insider, friends. My name is Tyler Patner, and today we've got an update to what has become a pretty well loved classic over the last couple of years. We have now the Avenger Bullpup 2. Two, meaning second generation, new version, right? Got some cool upgrades to talk about. Let's dive in. Now, the Avenger Bullpup came out in 2021 uh, and went very well received. Uh, sold a lot of them here at Pyramid Air. You've got a lot of great features built into this, like its longer brother, the Avenger Rifle. You've got an externally adjustable regulator and externally adjustable hammer spring uh, in a much more short, compact package, which I think a lot of you hunters out there liked a lot. But feedback-wise, right, scope sits really high on this model. And of course, a gripe of mine, you have to reach back here to cock the action, right? So uh, Air Venturi had their work cut out for them a little bit in terms of getting a new version out to you guys because like I said it's been a couple years since the original came out and now we finally have the Avenger Bullpup 2 and we've got some of those updates here so as you can see the scope rail has been shrunk down much closer to the action now it's about a half inch shorter so that's a good thing to see and my favorite thing here that we've got updated a forward mounted cocking lever you can expect the exact same goodness all right uh, should be very accurate uh, trigger is still adjustable, of course. Uh, you've got your mag storage at the back. You've still got your hammer spring adjustment accessible as well as your regulator adjustment and degassing accessibility also. Uh, butt pad still adjusts up and down, just pull it back like so. And you can even adjust the cheek piece. You take your knife or a pen or something, you just pop it in, the, you press that pin in and you slide this back and forth, very easy. Gun still comes with two magazines. You still have a single shot tray in the box, extra parts, all that jazz is there. You can see there's also some cool kind of molded stuff going on here to give the gun a little bit sleeker overall look. The only thing that is different in terms of the form factor aside from the scope and the cocking lever situation is the weight. Uh, this adds maybe about a quarter pound or so uh, to the existing Avenger Bullpup's weight. So a tad heavier, not really a big deal, um, but yeah, really solid feeling gun here. And as you guys can see, I mean, just so much nicer getting that cocking lever. It is a bit long, uh, but just so much easier to operate. One other thing I will add from a form and function standpoint, for those of you that maybe are using those larger capacity Avenge X magazines in your Avengers, you can't quite fit them in onto the Bullpup 2 because of this bar here. So uh, in the case of the larger mags, you can see I've got just a little bit of clearance there between the mag and the bar right there. And that is actually taken up with that larger mag, so it will not fit in entirely. Just a point of note there for you guys. But overall, same goodness, just a lot more, uh, there's a word for this. What is the word for comfortable? Ergonomic. Ergonomic, that's the one. Now, normally, friends, of course, we would do a full performance overview of the Avenger Bullpup 2, but we've kind of already done it with the original Avenger Bullpup uh, and all the, that material goodness, right? The regulated consistency, the power, the adjustability, it's all the same. You just have a more ergonomically friendly package and uh, not so high of a scope, so it's a little bit lower center of gravity overall. Both good things, I think you all will agree, but let us know down in the comments below. Oh, and I forgot to mention one thing, the price is the same. No price increase here. Hard to say in today's inflation heavy economy, if I do say so myself. Thank you all for watching. We appreciate it. For The Insider, I'm Tyler Patner. Don't forget to like, comment down below about the Avenger Bullpup 2 or whatever else air gun you want to talk about and subscribe. Keeps us going here on this side of the camera. We will see you next time. And I promise next time we will do some shooting. Check you later. Check you later. All right. Ergonomic, that's the one.